What's up, Gemini gang? Thank you for tuning in, Geminis. This is going to be for Gemini Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Also, check your North Note. It's not going to resonate with every Gemini energy that watches. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Or take it how it resonates to you in your situation. Personal readings in the description box. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, guys. Greatly appreciate it. <laughs> um, so death comes out. Mm -hmm. And it says, I'm learning that endings are merely beginnings. Yes. Imagination comes out. And it says, I embrace and nourish the creative aspect of my mind. All right, guys, let's see what's happening. Always take these, uh, how they resonate to you, Gemini's, okay? With the death card, I feel like there's some type of transformation. Humor, I saw this while I was shuffling. Um, I choose to focus on the lighter side of life, absolutely. And then blame comes out and it says, I accept responsibility for my well-being. Okay, so, um, interesting overall energy. Gemini's, I'm seeing a transformation. I'm also seeing you guys needing to tap into something creative. Whoa. The Chariot. First card, Cancer Energy. There's something that you are needing to go towards, uh, Gemini's, okay? Um, yeah, lots of cards came out. There's something you need to go towards with confidence, Gemini. Ooh, it's a connection. The Two of Cups with the Ten of Cups on the bottom. Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, lots of cards came out. Why is all these cards coming out? So, Gemini, you may be going towards a connection. Or someone's coming towards you. Wow, guys. The Ace of Cups. Huh. Okay. All right. I'm not taking all these. Lots of cards came out. I feel like someone isn't sure if you are with someone, uh, Gemini. Someone wants to have a new beginning with you, but they're not sure if they're not sure if you're with someone. They're not sure if your relationship status. Five of Cups, okay, and the Three of Wands on the bottom. Interesting. Um, I'm seeing some regret here. Whoa. Okay, so the Nine of Pentacles. Whoa, the Temperance. The King of Wands. The Star. Oh, wow. And the Knight of Cups with the Six of Swords on the bottom. Man, Geminis, what is going on here? So I feel like you are... Um, I'm still kind of not sure. I have a feeling that this could be a, a past person, but I'm still not sure. I mean, this could be a new energy, uh, Gemini's. Um, of course, I'm seeing two different energies here. It's only right. It's a Gemini reading. <laughs> um, I'm seeing that someone is seeing hope in the connection again. Uh, Gemini it could be you it could be someone in your energy um, or it could be you are seeing hope in your love life but I'm, I'm seeing some positive energy here after feeling like all was lost and all was gone yeah but I, I feel like you guys are starting to realize that everything's not gone like there's, there's something here that can be fixed 
um, there's something here that can be um, revived. There's definitely a transformation, though, that needs to take place. Whoa. The Knight of Wands. Mm -hmm. The Knight of Pentacles. I feel like, uh, Gemini, that damn Knight of Pentacles. Ciao. Um, with the chariot on the bottom again. I feel like someone is about to get out of this um, Knight of Pentacles energy. This is this is someone that I feel like you've been waiting on. Or I won't even say necessarily waiting on. This is someone that takes their time with doing everything. Um, yeah. This isn't, this isn't someone, though, that's going to give up on you, Gemini. So even if you think they've given up, they haven't. This isn't this person's not going to give up on you like ever could be an, a Leo, an Aquarius, a Pisces, a Sagittarius. Yeah, nope, this isn't someone that is is just going to give up, even if it seems like they have. Nope, because this person is is uh, working on something for you, planning something for you. Hopefully it don't take forever doing it. Yep, the high priestess. I feel like, um, like I said earlier, I'm getting that this person isn't sure if you are um, with someone or not. But I'm also getting, Gemini, you, um, oh, the moon, mm -hmm, and the knight of swords. See, that's, that's the vibe I'm kind of getting. They're not sure if you are with someone or not. I'm also getting, too, that you have no clue that this person is planning this. You have absolutely no idea. They're keeping this from you, though. Whatever this is that they have planned, um, you have no idea about this, Gemini. Well, until now, you have an idea now. <laughs> The temperance again and a whole bunch the ace of cups again the ten of cups the ace of wands the judgment the sun oh my gosh gemini's whatever this person has planned i think i'm going to pull another card for here but whatever this person has planned i feel like it's going to make you happy or that's their goal this person's goal is to make you happy they want you to be happy um and if you look at this picture, there's like flowers in his hand and all that. You know what I mean? Um, I feel like, too, this person has been kind of going through it as well. They've been kind of in regret. Um, they may even be lonely. I've been picking that up a lot for you guys. That five of cups in the moon. Um, it's kind of like I, I get like a self-pity energy. Kind of wallowing um, in self-pity and shit like that. <laughs> oh my goodness guys wow y'all <sighs> Gemini I feel like the two of wands clearly they they've chosen you to uh move forward with this you're who they want Gemini that's pretty obvious um where's my other deck I feel like though um with the star here, though, I, I feel like they are coming out of this self-pity energy. That may have been why they took so long. It could be financially, too. But I, I'm getting someone that has just been kind of like, you know, oh, well, Gemini's not talking to me. And Gemini might have moved on. And, you know, they have all these thoughts um, about what could go wrong. And uh, I feel like they're coming out of that. They're going to have to at this point or you're going to be, you know, on to something else. The Ace of Cups again, you guys. <laughs> oh, Lordy. Yes, Gemini's.
Lots of water energy here. Yep, the Knight of Swords. Something is about to be revealed, Gemini. I feel like they're going to have to start revealing their truth. I feel like, too, that whatever is being hidden is the fact that they're about to come towards you. We have three knights here. No, actually, we have all four knights here. The cups, the swords, the pinnacles, and the wands. Wow, Gemini. If you didn't think this person was coming back, they are. This is whatever this is. This person's not going anywhere. Um, this isn't over. You may have thought it was over, but it's not. Gemini. You may have thought they, they have given up. This person is never going to give up. <laughs> They're not going to give up on you, period. Four of Swords, y'all, that Five of Cups again. I told you, this person has been wallowing in self-pity for whatever reason, probably based on something that they've done. Yep, you thought that this was over. You have pulled your energy away from them and you thought it was over. But they're coming for you. This Knight of Swords is, is coming towards this Four of Swords here. Gemini. They're heading back quickly. And I feel like you're not even going to see this coming. Like, Yeah, Gemini. So I feel like you're not going to see this coming with this person. Um, however, let me say this though, Gemini. I feel like you can feel them. Ugh, look at that. The eight of wands on the bottom. I'm telling you, listen. I feel like you can feel them, though. Take it how it resonates. I know that's not going to resonate with everyone, Ooh, especially with that imagination here. Um, you can feel this person on their way back. You can feel when they're thinking about you. Um, I feel like your intuition is telling you that you're getting ready to hear from them. They may even be dreaming about you too. I've um have I gotten this for you guys before? That this person might be dreaming about you and trying to show up uh to you in dreams. Trying to communicate with you in dreams, uh, Gemini. This person's trying to communicate with you, um not necessarily physically. You may be dreaming about this person. Um, they're dreaming about you too, Gemini's. But I feel like you you know that I saw the Ace of Cups again. <clears throat> Lots of cards flipped over though. Yeah. You two have, have a really great um, connection. Well, I won't say great, but... <laughs> I'll say you two have a, a strong connection, a strong energetic connection. Um, you can feel each other's energy, and I know you can feel theirs, okay? So some of you may even know that this person's on their way back. It, it could be like through songs. Um, you may hear like particular songs and um, things like that, or you may hear their name, or you may see their name all over the place, and... You might be getting some signs, uh, Gemini, that this person is is uh, wanting to come back around. So take that how it resonates. King of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. The Eight of Wands again, guys. Yeah, I think y'all know. Y'all know that this person's on their way back. It really ain't much more for me to say about this reading. I feel like they're trying to keep it a secret, though, for whatever reason. Um... Or some, they want something to come to, uh, they want to reveal some type of secret. And I feel like it's it has to do with how they feel about you, Gemini's. Also, with, with what they've been doing uh, since the separation, because I'm seeing that they've been um, doing some work on themselves. Wedding. Oh my gosh. 
Reconciliation on the bottom. I told you, Gemini's. I told you. I see, and I was I was trying to not say the engagement or the the proposal. I'm seeing a proposal. Okay. Now I know that's not going to resonate with everyone. Okay. But I'm seeing it. They're doing something in secret. They're planning something in secret. It's not going to be secret long with the Knight of Swords. Whatever it is, it's, it's going to come to light. Okay. Um, for a lot of you though, take it how it resonates. You're going to know your story better than anyone. It's a proposal of some sort, uh, Gemini's. Okay. What's something else someone could could do? I'm trying to think. Like a promise ring or something like that. I'm seeing this person is planning something in secret for you. Gemini's. Make the, I'm telling you, make the effort. I can't make it up. I told you, Gemini's. This person is, they, of course, they're making the effort. They're planning something. For a lot of you, though, listen. <laughs> Don't say I didn't warn you, Gemini's. Don't say I didn't warn you. Codependency comes out. I keep seeing that for you, uh, Gemini, this codependency. And I've I've talked on uh, codependency a little bit in connections. I feel like this person is a little codependent on you. Um, it's, it's not totally a bad thing. Stay optimistic about your love life and you deserve love. All right, Gemini's. Let's do some hand retins, and then we're gonna get off here. Whatever they're planning, Gemini, I feel like you're gonna be very happy about it, or you're gonna be shocked. Even if you feel like this is done, Gemini, this isn't done. I'm better for you than they are. See, I said earlier, Gemini, that they're not sure if you're with somebody or not. For some of you, they may bring this proposal though. So, <laughs> so somebody else don't lock you down. And I'm just gonna be honest. I haven't seen this card in a while. So yeah, I did say earlier that they aren't sure if you're with someone. They want they want to know. I love you. Pray for me by Anthony Hamilton. I'm leaving them for you. Mm. That could be your energy. It's coming. Be open to receive. Lifetime by Maxwell. You know you miss me. Please take me back. We can't be friends. Do I have to beg you? Interesting. <laughs> I can't handle thinking of you with someone else. I told you, Gemini's. They're not sure if you... Some of y'all are entertaining someone else. I mean, that's just the bottom line. Um, You know, hey, it is what it is. They didn't want to act right. So, hey, you're not supposed to sit around and wait. Uh, Broken Hearted by Brandy and Wanye. Oh, and Twin Flames, Gemini's. All right, Gemini's, that's y'all's reading. If it resonated, hit that like, hit that subscribe. I appreciate y'all for watching. Peace out.